Good morning, everybody. Today is Thursday, the 12th of March. I am wearing clothing. I got my undershirt on. Um, this is my empty. But I'm also going to give you an update on my project pan because, look, I found my notebook. Um, last month, I used up 11 products. And it was a total of $65. Can you say, you know, store-bought? Um, this, uh, in February, I used up seven products. And I used up $58. So, all together, how much was that? Uh, a little more than $100. Um... So, 141. I actually wrote it down. So, altogether, I've used up 18 products. So, yay! Where's my other? I wrote down how much I used up in empties, too. But, uh, yeah, I can't find that. <laughs> it's on, It's in here somewhere. Okay, maybe the 111, I think, I don't know. I'll let you know. Okay, so here are my empties. I got a nice bag full of stuff. La, la, la. The first thing I want to talk about is these. I also have two puppy dogs down at my feet because it's raining in St. Louis. And, uh, they don't like that. But I got these out of Snack Nation. This is Farm to Bag Benitos. Um, original OMG sea salt black bean chips. I was not looking forward to trying these. But they were so incredibly good. So, would I buy those? Yes. Those were yummy. Okay, I didn't organize anything. I'm sorry. Okay, what do I got? Uh, good chemistry perfume. This was in my uh, sample Saturday. Very good perfume. Would I buy it? Oh, yeah, yes. Um, oh, I got this from Crazy for Samples. This is the uh, Priscilla Pro Clean Disc. Laundry detergent. This made my clothing smell so good. You know those little beads that you throw into your washing machine? They've got nothing on this. These. I'm going to the store on Saturday. I'm going to buy those on Saturday. All right. Global Beauty Pore Refining Hydro face hydro gel face mask aloe vera and tea tree i think yeah no i would not buy this again the mask tour and um yeah i just didn't like it it didn't do anything for me it mask tour no this is the uh molasses milk and oil body lotion um this smells so good um i got this in a care care box oh there's still a little bit oh it smells so good um and but a little bit goes a long way because it's oil i would put uh, a tiny bit in my hand rub it between my hand rub it on my legs Put a little bit more, rode it on the other leg. That lasted a long time, and that was a small, a small container. And I'm a big girl. So, this is the, the Body Shop Seaweed Oil Control Gel Cream. Um, combination to oily skin. I bought this a long time ago when I had more oily skin. 
now it's more dr getting dry and uh, I bought this and I bought their primer and they're both in the same con uh, containers or they were and um, I was using this as a primer <laughs> and then I read it um, so I stopped using it as a primer, used it as a moisturizer, and used it up. Uh, I'm not done with that yet. I have a habit of throwing the containers in here. I think I have another. Yes, I do. Okay. Olay, fresh out last. I got sparkling, and I got refreshing. Um, these are both wonderful. They make your skin very soft. They smell wonderful. Would I buy a big container? Yes. Okay. A couple years ago, I was sick at work. And um, this was after my stroke. And I was talking to... This is when I was working at a uh, residence home for the School of Medicine here in St. Louis. And uh, one of the kids brought down this. This is Nim Jion Pur Pa Ko, Herbal Dietary Supplement with Honey and Le Quant. Um, but you can also use it as, as cough medicine. And I this was a full bottle when I first got it. You only need... Like to take a tablespoon, let it coat your throat, and you stop coughing. Um, I was having an itchy throat. I went to go get this. I cannot take the lid off. It's sealed because it's very gooey. And yeah. So, and it's a few years old, so I'm throwing it away. Where, where, where? Come on. I know you're in here. Oh, these are my bite vitamins, beauty inside and out, dark chocolate. This has vitamin E, vitamin C, and biotin. And I like these. And I bought a container. I know they're not as good as Woman's Day, but Woman's Days are the pills are huge. And I want to take a break from them. So, I have a two-month supply of those. I'm going to use them. And then I find... I'll either go back to Woman's Day. Or I'll find something else. This is... Uh, Aloe Vista Cleanser Foam. I got this in... The hospital when they wouldn't let me get out of bed <laughs> and uh, I used it like once uh, you're not supposed to wipe it off and then I got my sister to bring me wipes when I, I and then they said okay we're gonna throw that away if you're not gonna take it home I'm like don't throw it away so I took it home I used it to wipe my makeup off at night when I was being lazy. And then I took a washcloth and wiped that stuff off. Um, was it the best thing? No. Would I buy it? No. Would I use it again if I was in the hospital? Yes. Okay. Biore. Free your pores baking soda. Uh, acne's out of here. Would I buy it? Yes, I will. This stuff removes your, uh, it's, uh, not only removes your blackheads, but it was an exfoliator, and I enjoyed it, so yes. This was the 111 skin, or 111 skin, for, uh, under eyes, eye, uh, serum. I didn't see anything. It, it didn't feel any better than... Anything else I was using. So I wouldn't. Okay, this is L'Oreal Infallible um, 
pinks in 300. I never even used it, but it smells really bad. So, would I buy it again? No. Just saying. This is a eyelash curler. I got this at the dollar store. And uh, then I stopped doing working with my eyelashes after my stroke. I kept that for five years. And uh, this week, or last week, I put on uh, mascara again for the first time. I had to get a new eyelash curler. So, you know. Am I wearing eye mascara today? No. Uh, the girls are in a mood and I'm kind of running late. Um, Dove Derma Series Dry Skin Relief Body Lotion. This was nice. This was not the best Dove I've ever had. Um, would I buy it? Probably not. But it was nice. It wasn't the best. This was clay mask duo. You got a eucalyptus clay mask and a charcoal clay mask. I got this at the dollar store, the Dollar Tree. And I used the eucalyptus first, and I did it on camera, and I took it off on camera. And I was like, nope, don't like this. It has a residue on my face. I'm going to wash it off. And then I let the puppies out. And I walked around doing other things. And then I was about to wash my face. And I realized how soft and shiny my face was. So I did not do that. And the charcoal also did that. Left the residue. It wasn't as nice as the eucalyptus. But I used it. And uh, I left it. And I liked it. Okay. Number seven. Protect at Perfect Intense Advanced Night Cream. I used this up. I really like it. Would I buy it again? Yes, I would. Right now, I'm going through all my samples that I've gotten in my Sample Saturday series to use those up before I break into my next one, which is a L'Oreal Revitalift Night Cream. Okay. Uh, Le Roche Posay and Thelios 60 Melt in Sunscreen Milk Fast Absorbing Velvety Finish for all skin types. It was good. I used it up. I'm happy with it. A tissue. Um. Bliss Lemon Sage Body Butter. Uh, this was not a body butter. This was more of a lotion. And it, it worked as a lotion, but it was not a body butter. It was too thin. Uh, did I like it? Yes, it smelled wonderful. Would I use it again? If I got it in a sample or a box. But I wouldn't buy it. Aquaphor Advanced Therapy Ointment Body Spray. I use this on my back. This is awesome. Would I buy it? I'm probably going to have to because I just finished up the last of my other sample and I don't think I have any more. But I won't buy it until next winter because that's when my back gets really dry. And because I was using that all winter, my back was not dry. Okay, pharmacy. I do. Total eye cream. Uh, I like this. Would I buy it? Sure. This is the Pixi Skin Treat Glow Tonic. A little sample. I use this for one of those masks that expand the sheet mask little things and uh, I liked it. It was nice. Both the girls are very upset right now. They're like 
why are you not paying attention to me? And why is not the TV on really loud so we don't hear anything going on outside? They don't understand. Okay. Uh, number seven. Restore and renew face mask multi-action serum. Um... I wouldn't buy it. They have others that I really enjoy that I would buy, but I wouldn't buy that. The Colgate Clean Mint. Uh, da, 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 da. Colgate Total Clean Mint. Um, this was a sample. I used it up. I liked it. It did feel like my mouth was clean. The I've discovered that the toothpaste that are like fruity flavored and stuff, I don't like. This is a night cream. I can't read the name. Oh, Newman QV, but it's a night cream. And, are you reading that? I liked it. In fact, I liked it so much when I pulled it out of my uh, sample Sunday. And then I pulled another one. I'm still using that. I used it last night. It's like a sleeping mask. I enjoyed it. What are you? No, you're nothing. Oh, a perfume. What's that? Okay. All right, here we go. The last few items. I have a perfume, and I think this was the one that I've already talked about. What are you? This is Tresemme uh, Botanique Color Vibrance and Shine Pomegranate and Camellia Oil Low Ladder Shampoo. And a, a conditioner. I did not. Uh, this has zero paraffins, dyes, silicone. And the conditioner has zero paraffins. It says so on back. Um, I didn't like the shampoo at first. Because I just had to keep adding shampoo to get any kind of lather. And I have short hair. And... I was like, oh no, this is not going to work. And then I was like, oh, I got to put the conditioner on. My hair is going to be so flat. Nope. My hair was very full. It looked really good. It was shiny. My sister said, did you get a haircut? And I'm like, no, it's a different shampoo. The only problem was, there, for this size sample, I can usually use it four times, and I used it twice. So, did I like it? Yes. Would I buy it? No. Not if I'm going to have to use a lot to get my hair shampooed. This is an unknown eyebrow liner, but I pulled it out of my stash to use it as an eyeliner. And I used it for about three months. And then I started getting eye infections. So I was like, goodbye. Would I buy it again? Sure, if I knew what it was. Okay, last one. This is Bobby Brown's See Perfect Skin, Not Makeup. They sent... A whole bunch of samples these little tiny sample things and one's for a stick one's for the liquid and they're both the same colors there was three different colors so for half my face I used the liquid and then on the other half I used the stick and I used these two these two were okay for me to use and it surprised me how little of a sample I needed to use on my face. Apparently, I'm using way too much conditioner or um, 
foundation. Did I like it? Yes, I did. Would I use it again? Yes, I would. Is it a little too expensive for me? Mm, maybe. Um, so, that's it. I lost the paper that I wrote uh, how much I... used up in samples. What did I do with that? I could have sworn I put it in this book. What did I do? I don't know. But, uh, I think it was like $151. It might be the 141 I think it was. I think I used up $141 worth of products. Am I happy about that? Yes. Um, because I'm going to put that in the bank. You guys, it's Thursday. We're almost home free. We're almost out of here. You have a good day. Be safe. Wash your hand for 20 seconds. That's all I got to say. Take care. Bye. Oh, wait. Virtual high five.